Article 1487. The expenses for the execution and registration of the seal shall be borne by the vendor unless there is a stipulation to the contrary. So, ang sabi nito, first, yung daw ating execution or yung deed of sale natin and yung registration nito ang general rule ang gagastos ay si seller pero so may exception dito si buyer kapag nasa stipulation so okay lang yun and then article 1488 The expropriation of the property for public use is governed by special laws. So, una, ano muna yung expropriation? So, ang technical definition niya is, so ito ay involuntary in nature. The owner may be compelled to surrender the property after all the essential requisites have been complied with. So, ibig sabihin ito, So, may properties yung isang tao tapos involuntarily i-compel or uh, pipilitin siya ng government na kuhanin nila yung property niya for public use. Example is yung um, bahay na malapit sa kalsada. If ever na magdadagdag sila ng si um, second lane or third lane. So, if matatamaan yung bahay mo, pwede nilang bibilhin yung bahay mo dahil gagamitin siya para makagawa ng kalsada. So, ano-ano ba yung requisites natin for exploration? So, first is taken by competent authority. So, yung mga may kakayanan na otoridad. Tapos, observance of the process of law, taking for public use dapat. And then, lastly, just for Um, payment of just compensation. So, ito yung market value and plus or minus something-something medyo complicated na siya. Basta itong expropriation is governed siya by special laws. And one thing, ito expropriation. So, di ba uh, magko-compensate si government? So, parang bibilhin niya yung property. Pero, hindi ito sale dahil ito ay involuntary. Para ito ay maging sale, dapat voluntary. So, ito ay expropriation lang. Hindi siya sale. And very short lang tayo. Please don't forget to subscribe. Thank you.